YouTube, it's Amy here and I'm in a bit of a mess because we're going on tour. It's only a week but um, I just wanted to show you my process of packing because it can be quite a mission and quite a task and I feel like we've done so much traveling that I've got it down to a T. Let me show you how it's done. So first of all I've got a new suitcase, got it on sale but I go through like two to four suitcases a year. I'll show you guys this. This came in the mail. I travel so much I'm now platinum velocity. Look out. In here you get your cards and these fancy things to put on your suitcase. So Ooh, fancy. Okay, so I've already packed my underwear so you guys don't have to do all that jazz. Um, so I'm going for seven days and what I do is I think of all the events that I have to do. So on this trip we've got the Robbie Williams support and we've also got um, a performance on the Today Show, which I need a cool outfit for, and we're performing for Fox FM in Melbourne. So that's three like stagey outfits that I need. So usually I start off by getting them out of my cupboard. So this is what I'm wearing to Robbie. It's from N.A. Katie, Naked Fashion. It's a little crop, some wide leg pants, which I'm super excited to wear. So one of the tricks to trade is rolling all of your clothes. This is one of the ways that I can wear many outfits on tour. I usually get either vacuum bags when I go overseas, um, which they seal up and you can make your clothes like this big. <laughs> um, or I roll, but this is gonna be two. And my Today Show outfit. So this is a beautiful age outfit that I bought. RIP bank account. Gently put that over this side with my other stage outfit. And that's the matching top. <laughs> Oh, this is my third stage outfit, which is from Alice McCall. I bought it yesterday. And it's a little cute denim skirt. And this is to die for. The material is incredible. And it's an off the shoulder shirt, which I'm going to tuck in. So, yeah, that's going to be my Fox FM performance. Good. Squeeze it down so there's more room. <laughs> now, I always pack an extra couple of outfits because you never know what's going to like crop up or you might have to run into some other radio stations or sometimes they put some TV on, put you on the spot with some TV. So um, this is my backup outfit. It's also Alice McCall. It's off the shoulder top and the same skirt but in black denim because I couldn't decide between the two. Tough life. Next, I'm going to pack my exercise gear because I'll probably only get two sessions in. Um, normally when I'm home I train like five times a week, but um, I'll probably realistically get one or two if I'm lucky. So I'm just going to pack two um, workout gear, two sets of workout gear, save the whales. You can see I have really fancy active wear. <laughs> two sets of Lululemon active wear pants, down in the very corner. <laughs> Look, I've got some tinsel from our video clip on my floor. All right, so I always pack a pair of bathers because you never know. And I don't like being underprepared. We might end up in some cool hotel that has an awesome spa and sauna and I don't want to miss out on that. So always pack, even if I'm going to somewhere where it's going to snow, I always pack togs. All right, so we're going to Melbourne um, on this trip. So we're like Sydney, Melbourne, and then back to Sydney. And Melbourne can have four seasons in a day, as we all know. So um, I'm going to pack some jeans, but still ones that I could possibly wear if it's not, you know, summer with a little, like a little cami, or I can wear it with a jumper and make it more warm. So these are just high-waisted, ripped boyfriend jeans. Alright, so I've packed quite a lot already, and look at how much space I've used. Not much. Still tons of room. I'm just going to throw in another extra t-shirt. Love this one. Go have five yourself. So then I'm just going to pack the rest of the outfit that I have for the five other days. And these are just some cool pants, easy to wear. I probably read them at rehearsal. The white tee. And also white tees are really versatile, so I try and pack things that I can mix and match and wear more than once if I need to. Black cami because it goes with everything. Versatile. 
You never know when you're gonna need it. You can wear it under, you can wear it over. So that guy's going in. Again, with versatility, I've got this skirt from Rodeo Show. Uh, it's nude and goes with everything, so I pack it all the time. So that guy's going in. I love these ones because they are really detailed and you can dress them up or wear them casually and it still looks nice. And this is one of my favorite dresses. It's Mr. Zinni. It's just fun, it's pretty, it's cool because it's really hot here in Australia right now. Uh, I've got to pack pajamas, of course. So, got my Vegemite pajamas from Peter Alexander. And this, for my pajama top. <laughs> Alright, so I'm nearly done packing. The hardest part is the shoes. Leather jacket, this one's from All Saints. I saved up so much for this jacket because um, I feel like every girl needs a real leather jacket in their wardrobe. They just go with everything and you never know when you need it, especially in Melbourne. Socks. Don't forget socks. Always take band-aids because I always have blisters from silly shoes. Panadol. <laughs> Has to come everywhere with me. Brow game strong. I got it from Brow Lust and um, comes everywhere with me because you just don't know when you need to sleep, how much sleep you're going to get, um, or what the hotel room's going to be like. So, um, makeup bag. So this is the best. I got this on sale as well, Boxing Day Sales. So I keep all my lashes. There's all these compartments that you can keep random stuff in it. This is my lipsticks. Just a few. <laughs> Highlighters and blushes. This is my scent, by the way. It's Dior Addict, and it smells so good. And if you want to know what I smell like, that's it. Makeup case at the bottom. So these are awesome for traveling. All the makeup brushes in there and they don't get squashed and misshapen. And they do your makeup nicely. This guy is really cool. I'm actually bringing this for um, our in-ear engineer who's a female. And it's a makeup remover glove. Frida! Oh my god, that's awesome. Anyway, it's a um, it's just a mitt, and you can take off your makeup without using any water. So that's really awesome for on the road, because sometimes you don't get to even have a shower after you go on stage. You just get right into the van to the next city. So I always travel with these. They're awesome. So shampoo, and conditioner, fake tan, and a moisturizer. And I put that in a really heavy duty plastic bag because. They always leak. How's the suitcase looking? <laughs> I just find it easy to keep everything in little bags so then you can just pull them out and keep it all together. So in here I've got my hair straightener. GHD, I've got hairspray, heat protector, you name it, I got it. Okay, now the hard part. The shoes, stage shoes. This is my resin art, I made it. It stays in this back YouTube room. So these are my stage shoes. I'm literally taking them all around the world. Um, I don't want to let them go because they just go with a lot of things and they're easy. The heel's really thick so I can run around comfortably with them. I got these on sale as well for Zimmerman. And um, going in. I'm going to wear these on the plane tomorrow. So um, it's always a good idea to wear like heavier shoes on the plane so you don't have to worry about packing them. They're staying out. And these are my favorite shoes ever and they're dying because I've worn them, I've worn them, I've worn them. They're from Tom Gunn, but they um, sadly closed down. I can't get any more of them. But they're another pair of shoes that just go with everything. I can rely on them. Trusty gold ankle boots come with me everywhere. Got a pair of sunnies. I'm just gonna take one because it's just a week. All my jewelry. Got some fun ones from Kenzie. Some fancy ones from Valerie. Oops. So again, you want to pack things that are just going to go with everything. Got my Beats headphones. I was really like apprehensive to buy them because I wasn't sure if I'd use them. But since I bought them, I've used them every single trip. And they cancel out all the noise. And um, if I'm traveling, I put rain noise on, I put these on, I sleep like a baby. So yep, yeah, that's the color I got. Easy to travel with, 
So I'm just going to clip these to my handbag. I think that's everything. I'm taking two handbags. I need one that will fit my beats and all that stuff in it. And then I need a little, just a day bag, tiny one. All right, so obviously I'm gonna add in my little toiletries, which contain like face wash, mini face wash, toothbrush, all that good stuff. Um, I, I'll add that in tomorrow, because I need it tonight. So yeah, there you have it. Done. And setting out and thinking what you actually need. Don't need. <laughs> Thanks for tuning in, guys. Uh, if you enjoyed the video, don't forget to subscribe below. And um, we have a whole bunch of new stuff coming. We've got an album coming out this year, so um, we're going to give you a ton of footage and content to uh, be a part of. So don't forget to subscribe, leave a comment below, and if you have any questions for me, don't forget to ask. Thanks!